Hi guys, Wednesday 9th of September, just going on 10 o'clock in the evening on the east coast of Australia, where I am, you can see the times here. This is a quick one, nothing to do with draining the swamp, but everything to do with corruption. You'll remember this story, Jim Stone. I brought this to your attention a couple of days ago. Boom, COVID-19 test kits ordered in 2018 and they screwed up their cover up. And then I found this on 8 Coon. Countries traded huge quantities of coronavirus test kits in 2018. The World Bank attempted to cover up the trade logs and they failed. Just found this and did a little digging myself. Trade logs from the World Bank indicate large quantities of test kits were already traded back in 2018. The World Bank and the World Trade Organization attempted to cover it up, but they failed. And then he gives us the links. So this was the page out of World Integrated Trade Solution talking about COVID-19 diagnostic test instruments and apparatus exports by country in 2018. And you can see that was basically archived September 6, 2020, 1.40 Eastern Time. And then this page where it's called Medical Diagnostic Test Instruments and Apparatus Exports by Country 2018. And this page, September 6, 2020, 1019. And just take a minute and have a look at the countries here. And remember, the trade value is a thousand US dollars. So you need to multiply these figures here by a thousand dollars. Just gives you an idea and have a look at who's involved. Australia, of course, 550 million dollars 550 million dollars and we're shut down here in victoria for what the other question is who produced these test kits the united states correct me if i'm wrong here two billion so that's two two trillion is it honestly these figures are just mind-blowing and you can see every country was involved this is some sort of scam no doubt about it, these people were warned. Why were they ordering these COVID-19 test kits? If they bought them in 2018, they could have ordered them as early as 2017. What's going on? And this anon gives us a bit more information. Freeze the screen, have a look, read it for yourself. It goes in hand in hand with Event 201, people. We've been scammed and I think we've found the proof. But will it get out? Will enough people see it? Will I be taken down before I, you get the chance to have a look at it? I don't know, but this is big. That's why I'm giving you this vid now. Have a good day, guys. This is awful. Stay sane, seriously. It's very hard, isn't it? But we're all in this together, as they say in the classics. Cheers.